Why be a member of a church? Well, lots of people are not. And for many of them, they have reasons that are justifiable. That those of us who are committed to being a part of a certain church or a congregation, that we're members and we attend regularly, we need to be empathetic, to be careful with those who tell us that they've been wounded by the church. There's a story in the New Testament of when Jesus is about to be arrested, that one of his disciples draws a sword and starts swinging. And he cuts off the ear of a man who is there to arrest Jesus. Far too often, Christians today feel like they need to defend Jesus, even to the point of harming other folks. And Jesus, they forget, is strong enough to take even crucifixion and defeat death. He is able to absorb our sin and change it into grace and forgiveness for us. And so the last miracle that Jesus performs before his death is he heals that man's wound. We as Christians and those of us who are committed to be members of a church, if we hear of the pain of other people and they choose not to be a member of a church right now, our first response needs to be love and grace. And needs to be the reminder that while Jesus heals us from the wounds of others, we also need to ask him to heal the wounds that we've inflicted on others. Why be a member of a church? Many people are not. But we would hope and pray that if they were to join, that they would find the healing of Jesus there.